never saw a door like that! Me neither! Oh, that reminds me, I dare you to go into his house, whoever he is! Ah, <laughs> uh, you know what? I I'll just live instead! Hey! You better do it, or else! Or else what? Or else I will go in there and maybe be killed by that guy instead, so that you will never see me in your life! Alright! I'll do it! Good decision! Hey! <gasps> what are you doing here? I had enough of you over here. You, you, you got it all wrong! I didn't force myself to kill it! Listen to me. You can't go around my house like that. Wait! <laughs> Listen. I can't have you around my house like this anymore. Yeah, what? You beat up those birds, right? Yeah, but that was a few days ago. Well, listen, we have another problem. What problem? Well, even worse! The news said all the people were killed at the White House at Washington, D.C. yesterday. And guess what? What? That biggest bad mystery guy of all time is kind of heading where we live right now. Oh, sh**. We have to get to the lab and meet my best friend of mine. You're gonna tattle on me? No! I mean, we have to go tell my friend. What, your girlfriend? Now you son of a bop, say it! Well, it's Griff, my man. How are you today, Well, Yeah, it's been tough since I had this job. Yeah, it's been like hell this month. Then it has been, and we don't have a lot of problems. But except we have a mysterious problem we will ever have for this job. And what is that? Someone killed everybody in the White House. Oh, God! It's true. We have a newspaper here, and it said it happened. Oh, God! Stop saying that, Bob, damn it! Sorry, Hot Wing! Mm hey, I'm sorry! You dick! Okay, apology accepted. Okay, so we need something that will help us on the way. I got just the thing! Hell yeah, it's what I want! It's what we want, you miserable a-hole! Hey, can, can you walk faster, dick? Uh, hell no! 
Well, do you want a hot girl? Oh yeah, you bet. All right, let's go. Hey, do we have what we need? Because I had something in a long time. And what's that? I'll show you. This is a gun that I had for a while since seven years. That's great, man. Call me big man because I'm bigger than you. Dick. All right, let's go. Hey, big man, I never saw a room like this. I'm serious, man. Never. Call me big man. Sorry. Listen, I know you're having trouble remembering my name, but I can't say the way how those stupid people say it. The door just opened behind John, me. are you listening to me? <laughs> Big man John. How the hell did you know my name? I heard that you were on the news. They said you guys were about to find out who killed everyone at the White House. Yeah, that's what we're doing. And what's your name? Everyone calls me Tigra. Huh. Nice. I like it. I can say the F word right now. Listen, I know you're trying to find that murderer. I think I can tell you who he is. And what's his name? His name is Arlo Nelson. Arlo Nelson, right? Right. He had a wife named Gnarly Thelma. She was a very nice dog, but... Wait, he married a dog? They're both dogs, you dick! Anyways, she was nice, but... She died. So he started having money problems and I don't know what else has happened to him, but he started doing murdering ever since he lost his wife. I don't know what the hell has happened to him, but if we can find someone who can tell us more information about him, then we can find him. I think I know a guy who can tell you guys about him. And who's the guy? His name is Broco Donald. He'll tell you everything about him. He knows him. Very well. Broco? We need your help. So, what do you need help with? Uh. John, shut the hell up. Sorry, man. Call me Big Man! Listen, sir, we just want to know a guy named Arl Nelson. Do you have any information about him that you know? Oh yes, that guy. I know him. Where do you guys live? I'm just saying. We live in Colorado. Well, I live in Richmond. But okay, I'm sorry about that. Um, about Arlo. Um, he wanted to do murdering. And is that right? Right, yeah. He had a friend named Dave. And he died because he had cancer still with medical problems. And why did he want to start a biggest murder fear in Washington, D.C.? Because he got fired on his job after when his wife died. Now we film her. Yes, that's her. She died by the lightning storm when he went for a date in the mountains. What the f***? He came here five days ago and told me to keep this a secret. He's heading to where you guys live and killing people there. If you don't want that to happen, I suggest go back to your house to save our lives for the United States. Hang on for a sec. Hey, 
anything else that you want to say? Uh, no, that's it. You can go. Before you leave, there's a big gun under the couch that I had in your house a long time ago. Thank you so much. Let's kick some boobs. Mm. Yeah, let's kick some whatever you said. Yes! There it is. Now time to save the U.S. I don't think so. What the f***? Arlo Nelson! You're absolutely right. You were the one that caused the murder in the White House, right? No, someone else did it. And it could be one of the top 10 biggest murders in the United States. It could be the world's largest murder. Wow, that's hilarious. <laughs> but stupid as shit. And what the hell are you doing here? Let me see it. We are just about to go to Dunkin' Donuts. Is that right? You stupid dick pants. Oh, you're going to Dunkin' Donuts. How about Dunkin' as Dickin? <laughs> All right, well, you both have fun. All right, thank you so much. What the hell is that? We could have taken him and took him to jail. Well, I had no choice. Well, tell me, did you shook in the prison yet? Let me just say, no. What? I thought you did. We tried to get him, but we were afraid that we were going to get killed or something. No, it's because you were being an asshole scare. <laughs> nah, he's lying. No, you are lying. I heard that. I'm sorry you got scared. I didn't get scared. Don't raise your voice like that, man. Call me Big Man! What the f You can't do a job like that. Real spies have to do what they have to do. I know the job is always complicated, but it's your choice. You can keep your job or quit. It's up to you. I don't know. Come on, let's go. We'll meet again, right? Yeah. Yeah. I don't think we'll meet again. Hey, big man. I brought you water to drink and popcorn for me only. Hey, don't worry if you didn't catch him in time. No, I'm not worried. I'm just worried about losing my job. No, you're not going to lose your job, even though you were afraid to catch him. I mean, come on. I'm just worried about that he's going to kill other people out there and will have a huge problem. Oh. You know what? I think you should go home and take a rest. Oh, wait, I remembered something at home. Can you give me that ice cream that I left there? Um, sure. Wow, we meet again. Arlo Nelson, I knew you were in the guy in that room. Well, this will be the last thing I'll do. They're just murdering in the Washington DC WH. What does it stand for? White House, you demoloid. Now, my next murder is to try to kill you guys. That's it, you
son of a goose bump! I can't believe you just did that! I'm so screwed! Oh! <laughs> Tigra! I think John is missing! Do you have any idea where you saw him last? Um, last time when I saw him was at the joining room. Do you know where he could be? Um, I let him get my ice cream that I left at my house, and that's all I could think. Okay, go check. Okay. Jesus! John! John, can you hear me? Where the hell is he? Where the hell is he? Oh, I forgot about my ice cream. Oh my god, big man! John! Oh my god! Ah! What the jiggle is were you thinking, man? It wasn't my fault. I just got kidnapped. Don't move. Arlo Nelson! Arlo? Why the hell did you do that murder? Well... I'll tell you. The reason why I did this all along was because you guys were very rich people on Earth and I was not. Then I started planning for years. What's for both of you? To die. It doesn't matter if you become rich. What matters is you should not be miserable murdering people. Yeah. Well, I don't care. Oh, it doesn't matter because this ends now. Ah! I love this job. I hate this job so much. Where'd you go? I'm right behind you. Ah! So, gonna beat the crap out of you! You know what? This really ends now. Oh my donkeys. I can't believe you did it, big man. Yeah, I I think I did it. And where are we going to put the dead body? <laughs> Hello everyone, we all want to know this number one breaking news today. So you know, it all started from the murder of Washington DC, and about that, Big Man John sitting in the- oop, sorry, um, about that, was that Big Man and John saved the day by taking down R.O. Nelson, the one who did the huge murder. So Jason, what do you have to say about this? Well, I have to say, since he was the one doing that hugest murder, he should be killed. And by the way, we just found his dead body where they live. And we'll talk about that soon. But for now. We go to our weather forecast. Dylan? Well, the sun thunderstorms happening around Colorado, and as we see here, it's been too Um, big man? Uh, we'll have some temperature, and it's gonna get a little bit hotter. Um, as, as can we have a talk? And a rich man? 
Hey, that was funny the way how it said this ends now. I like that. <laughs> ah, never mind. So what is it? Um Do you want me to leave or stay? <sighs> leave. Why? Because I live on my own. I understand. Hey, John. How about you stay? Oh my god, sure! Alright, um, do you, John, want to join the real team of this job? Yes, sir. Then you, sir, will have this. <gasps> You're welcome. Now, do you want to drink with me? Sure. Who farted?